Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a short and sweet tiny little haul of some Target Threshold wax melts for you guys. Now I was scrolling through my wax Instagram and I came across someone's post who had hauled these. Now I don't know if she wants to be identified or not. I know that she does watch my channel so hello if you're watching um, but because I respect people's privacy I don't know if they always want to have a shout out or anything like that. Um, so if you do, you can leave a comment down below and I can, you know, uh, update the description with your social media handles if you want. But uh, yeah, so I saw that she had hauled these and I thought it was so cool. I really wanted some just because these are like mix and match like clamshells. There are three different scents in each one and you can like break them apart and blend them. And I thought that was amazing. I love blending scents. I love... Um, making my own concoctions sometimes so that really appealed to me uh so i went over to my local target and i picked these up to my knowledge i think these are the only two that are mix and match at least where i was i only found these two that had like the three different scents um but i believe you can get each of these scents individually as well uh so if you really like one particular scent you can get a full size clamshell in just that scent um so these are 2.5 ounces each which I believe it's like typical clamshell size um, and these were two dollars a piece which I thought was a really great deal so uh, yeah without further ado I'm just gonna get started on some of the scents so um, I also liked that they made the clamshell like this so that's really easy just to like break apart one piece uh, because you know if it were like wax cubes maybe cutting them up would be a little harder so these are just so easy just break off a piece and blend with each one you can you know melt three of them or two and then one like the ratios can be different really the possibilities are endless so I just really like that concept um so yeah I'll get started with this one which is more of a fruity sort of mix so the first one here is green mango and pomelo so I'll just do a tiny little um you know cold sniff review so this is what it looks like so it's green uh, peach and yellow so the green let me take it out okay there you go so let me sniff this um, green mango and pomelo oh that is so good I think out of all the scents this is my favorite I would definitely go back and pick up a full size of this oh yeah that's beautiful so to me pomelo is sort of like a sort of like a grapefruit kind of scent and I love grapefruit scents now this is not a sweet fruity scent by any mean because that green mango it's it's definitely a green mango you know the mangoes that you can get that are like green red and like yellow it's like a like a triad of colors like that is that kind of mango and it smells like it has the skin still on it it's tart and with that pomelo it is just so beautiful and that greenness from that skin of the mango it is so good it smells very similar to one of my favorite scents ever from vendor wax so yeah it smells almost exactly the same to be honest almost very similar but yeah this is my favorite and I would definitely pick some up however like I said I know that most people don't like really tart and almost sour fruits so because of that you can mix this so if something is a little bit too sweet for you you can use that to tone it down or if this is too sour for you you can mix it with a sweet scent so that's what I really like so that is green mango and pomelo and then let's try the next one oops sorry this one is berry, lemonade, and melon. Hmm, this is really nice. You definitely smell that berry, lemonade sort of note. It smells like a berry lemonade that you can find at a store. Mm, I don't know if I could really pick up a melon to be honest with you. Yeah, I really can't pick up a melon. Maybe like a hint of a cantaloupe almost, but honestly just the berry lemonade. I do like this scent. Yeah, but it's not like super unique, but I do like it, so that's great. And then moving on, now this next third one is, let's see here, pineapple, sage, and sugarcane. Oh yeah, this is definitely pineapple. You know, pineapple can be sort of tart. This is like an in-between pineapple. It's like a little bit sweet, but not overly sweet, juicy pineapple. I can't really smell the sage per se. It's just a, like a tart and sweet pineapple scent, so... I quite like that so that's very nice um i can imagine mixing all three together would be beautiful just like the best summer drink tropical fruity drink so 
Yes, so the next one I have here is Lavender White Tea, Eucalyptus Leaf, and Tangerine Ginger. So um, this is a little bit more interesting, I would say, because there's a hint of like a fruitiness, like a calming scent, and, and another sort of calming scent. So um, this would also be really cool to mix together. I imagine the Eucalyptus and Tangerine Ginger would make a pretty cool mix. So uh, yeah, let's sniff this. So uh, these are the colors, a lavender, a green, and a little orange color. So let's me open this. Sometimes it's hard to get the pop them out. But yes. So there it is. So this lavender and white tea. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh, I really like that. I would definitely pick this up in the full size as well. Mmm, this is just such a calming white tea and lavender kind of scent. It's not, um, there's no vanilla notes. It's definitely sort of an herbal lavender with a very beautiful fresh white tea. It's so relaxing. It would be perfect for like a bedtime kind of melt. Mm, I love that. That is so, so good. And it smells very nice as well. Um, sometimes there are so many different kinds of lavenders, but this is a good lavender. Mm, beautiful. I love that one. Okay, let's try eucalyptus leaf. So this one should be pretty simple, probably just eucalyptus, so. Hmm. Yeah, and it's just eucalyptus. Now, this one is not as astringent as some eucalyptus I found. This is more of a softened sort of eucalyptus scent. It smells almost like there's a hint of like a, like a sweetness to it, like a sweet eucalyptus almost, but not super sweet, just a hint. Because, um, you know, I've smelled eucalyptus essential oil, you know, sort of like the very um, aromatherapy essential oil diffuser kind of eucalyptus scents before. And this is not quite that, but it's very pretty. I like it. And it is relaxing as well. This would be very nice um, as a bedtime melt as well. And I love melting eucalyptus with uh, fruity scents. I think it just adds a lovely green, um, relaxing note to fruity scents. So I'll probably be mixing this with some, uh, fruitiness. And the next one here is tangerine ginger. So, oh, that's interesting. That's really lovely. So this is definitely like a citrus kind of scent. It's sweet though. It's like a sweet citrus. So not a super bright citrus almost. This is like a sweet orange kind of scent, sweet tangerine. And that ginger adds this sort of like zestiness to it. It's very beautiful. It's quite nice. More of a, uh, more unique because of that ginger note, but a sweet ginger, almost like a candy ginger and sweet orange tangerine kind of scent. So that's quite nice as well. And so these are all the, um, you know, the mix and match threshold target wax melts that I found. Honestly, all of these are very good scents on their own, but I can imagine you can really kick it up a notch by melting these together and mixing them as well. So yeah, I definitely want to pick up the lavender white tea and the green mango and pomelo again because those are really, really good. I really enjoy it. But uh, yeah, so thank you so much for watching. Let me know if you guys have tried these or picked any of these up or if you tried any threshold wax melts. These are the first threshold wax melts that I've tried. I have tried other Target wax, but it's not the threshold brand and uh yeah so if there are other ones in this collection that are also mix and match please let me know but these are the only two that i found oops i sort of messed up the clamshell there but yeah so thank you so much for watching and have a beautiful day